Hi. So today I'm going to be showing you how to install a test installation of WordPress extremely easily so that you can test plugins or themes or any other content that you're developing or testing for your actual environment. So there's a website called Turnkey Linux and they make a number of pre-made virtual machine images that are extremely easy to use, extremely easy to set up. So that's what we're going to be using for our WordPress test environment. So if you download the WordPress appliance from the turnkeylinux.org website, they will give you a zip file. And if you open up that zip file, you will get a VMX and a VMDK file. These are virtual machine disks and virtual machine image files that you can open using either VirtualBox, which is free software from Oracle, or you can use VMware Fusion or VMware Workstation uh, if you paid for a license for that software. So whichever one you choose to use, if you double click the VMX file, it will open in your virtual machine library the turnkey WordPress installation. So this will go through its setup for the first time. And you'll get some prompts here. It's going to be asking you for some passwords. So make sure you use strong passwords. I'm just using root root right now. Um, but that's, and make sure you write them down as well because you'll probably need them later. So it's going to ask you for password for the root account, the MySQL root account, and the WordPress admin account. And then it'll ask you for an email. And then it's going to ask if you'd like to initialize hub services. And basically this is for backing up your installation to an off-site backup. Um, you don't necessarily need to do this for a basic installation, so I just recommend hitting skip. But if you're an advanced user and you'd like to back up your test environment, then this is something that you can do at this point. For now, I'm just going to skip it. So uh, it's also going to prompt you for updating security. Um, I recommend that you install the updates because you'd like to have the most recent version of not only the operating system, but also all of the software on it. Alright, so this is a great chance to show you what happens if you get errors. So in this case, the reason that you're getting an error is because, or in my case, it's because I'm bridged to the network and my service provider only provides one IP address. So what you can do is change it to NAT, and when it reboots, it'll install the updates from the network. Now it's going to tell you that networking is not yet configured, so we're going to go back and we're going to reboot here because once you reboot using NAT it will obtain an IP address from your computer. All right, so now it's obtained IP address information. You can see here that the IP address is 172.16.242.133. And that is going to be the I or the uh, address that you use to access the WordPress installation. So if we go ahead here and go back to our browser, we go to 172.16.242.133. You'll see the turnkey welcome to WordPress page and then you can log in as admin using your password and you'll see your WordPress installation. Uh, I do recommend that you update to the latest version of WordPress by clicking the update. 
It also provides a number of other access points here. You can get a web shell, which allows you to interact with the virtual machine through a web browser. Uh, it just provides a standard shell. Uh, you can also use SSH, SFTP to transfer files back and forth using this address, or you can access the PHP MyAdmin installation via this address. And that is absolutely everything that you need to know in order to set up the turnkey Linux WordPress test environment in about five minutes. So thanks for watching, and be sure to let me know if you have any questions.